Hello, my name is Ruben Caputo and I'm going to show you how to find the blog in Blackboard and how to respond to it. So follow along. Excellent. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to open up Blackboard. Here, of course, you want to log in first. Okay. Now, you'll see here on the top, you'll see your courses. So if you click on courses, and on the left here, you'll see a little box where the mouse is. You're going to click on your course. In this case, we're going to click on EAD555. <clears throat> Excellent. So here you're going to click on tools in your EAD section. Once you click on tools, you'll see a lot of tools here, and these are separate buttons. But really, what we want to get to is to the blogs. So we're going to click on blogs. And from here, once you click on the blog section, you will see. Um, all the activity that the students have done and how you can tell from that is through the number of entries so for example human capacity week one you'll see here where I'm kind of underlining here I'll bold it here real quick where it says entries so that has a parenthesis here that 35 of them were new so these are the number of entries that were inputted so let's say we're going to click on human capacity week one Perfect. Now, one thing to draw your eyes and your attention is here on the right side where it says more blogs. Now, you'll see the roster, so all the names of the students here. For example, we'll take Andrew Green. And if we click on Andrew Green, you'll notice that in parentheses it says two, meaning he wrote two blogs. So here on Saturday, December 3rd, 2011, he wrote his blog at that time. And he wrote also a blog here on the lit key. So in order to make sure that they're receiving the response, you have to click on the comment button. So once you click on the comment button, this window will appear. This is where you input your comment. And once you're done, you're going to click on add. I won't for this purpose, just because of it's, it's a demo. Um, the student will see your comment, and then they can always check back on their Blackboard to read your comment. So, that is just pretty much a small little tutorial video. Yes. So I hope this was informative, and if you have any questions, you can feel free to email me, my email, and hopefully this was helpful for you. Yeah.